Hello everyone and welcome to Tech Shops. In this video I'm going to show you how to set up the Google Accessibility Scanner for Android on your phone, tablet or even your Fire Tablet. So that is what I'll be doing in this video. So, so, so first of all the Google Accessibility Scanner, believe it or not, enables you to detect accessibility problems in apps. Those include unlabeled buttons, which we always discuss in these videos, as well as text contrasting. And it's basically trying to make your apps or other apps screen reader friendly, as well as accessible to everyone. So that is the accessibility scanner app. We did try setting it up in another video, however that video did go pear-shaped, so I'm hoping that this video should go without a hitch. So the, so the accessibility after installation is called Scanner. Sometimes we jump the gun and allow some of the permissions before we launch the app, but in this case we're going to set things up through the app. So this is like a tutorial and when you got get started when you see the turn on accessibility scanner that's in the accessibility section and that basically allows the app to run in the background and analyze the apps to do its job. So down here we see Accessibility Scanner and we've clicked on that and we're going to click the switch and then it's got a warning sign telling us that this app could potentially collect sensitive information but that is what this app is supposed to do. Now I think the Okay folks, we are back with you. I think I know what happened with the accessibility scanner. The icon wasn't to the very top right or the very bottom right, but instead it was sort of in the middle of nowhere. So when I was looking for the icon, obviously it was being distorted by other icons that were around it. So before we open an app and scan it, let us tackle this problem by moving the icon. So to move the icon, if you are a TalkBack user, you double tap and hold, and then you can literally drag your finger to your desired position. So it, it was probably working all the time, but because I couldn't really access the icon properly, then that was why we came across what we came across. So for demonstration purposes we'll be scanning the Total Commander File Manager app and when I click the start scan button 